It is not moving very fast. You can see uh, about 15 minutes ago, the circulation was there, and then I'll go back forward, and you can see it's moving almost due north uh, across the uh, airport property. So uh, it, it has strengthened over the course of that past 15 minutes or so, uh, a tornado warning in effect for the area. Uh, taking a look at the rest of the country, we have several features that are all also giving heavy rain and severe storms. We have one upper air feature that's sliding across the Carolinas into the mid-Atlantic, another that's sliding across uh, Texas into Louisiana, and a feature that's going into the Great Lakes. A bigger feature that over the next few days, you can see it counterclockwise rotating here, will become dominant for the northern plain. So today we do have severe threats here and there, so spotty damaging winds from the Carolinas down into parts of Louisiana and Texas, and then uh, up in the high plains area where the southeast winds come in, uh, they are lifted up over that high terrain and anywhere from Wyoming down into Colorado and uh, later on into parts of Kansas, Oklahoma and the Texas panhandles, as well as with the approach of that upper low, perhaps some storms that are into the Montana area. Uh, we will see tomorrow a little bit more of a concentration of the storms uh, up in the Montana.